Hello everyone, this is a video showing my electronic Farkle game that I made. Um, Farkle, for anyone that's not played it, is a six um, dice game, and you can basically ro uh, roll the dice and get different scoring combinations. Um, here's kind of a scoring table here, um, showing how to play the game. I wrote an Instructables on this, and you can follow the, the link in the description to that to see how I made it, but I just wanted to make this video um, kind of showing off how it looks. So I created a little case for it, um, a little cover with an acrylic sheet to prevent dust from collecting on it, and um, just to kind of keep it protected. That comes off, and then here's the actual game. I 3D printed this back and added a um, a clear gloss finish to it, and I think it turned out really nicely. It fits well in my hand as well. So I'll go ahead and turn the game on. It's a little switch on the side here. It's powered with the LiPo battery. I added this little piezo here to um, add some sound, and the first thing that pops up is kind of an instruction to the player. So on the OLED on the bottom here, um, it asks to figure out how many players are to play the game. And basically, you can go ahead and touch these pads and it changes corresponding to what the player wants. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Currently, I have it set up for two to six players. So just as an example, we'll click two players and hit roll. So this is the start of the game. When you hit roll, the dice roll and it gives you um, six different die. And the way Farkle is played... Again, I have a link in the description, but there's point values based on different die combinations. So just looking at what I have here, really the only thing I have is a, a 1 and a 5. So when you click the die, if you have a point combination, it real-time updates your point value on the 7 segment. Um, you can click it again to, to deselect the die. So right now the 1 is selected. I can deselect it. I have no points. Select it. Select it. In this case, I have 150 points. I can either roll or pass to the next player. In this case, I'll roll again. And again, here I still have a combination, I can, or I still have a scoring chance, I can select one. And I'll just go until I Farkle just to show what that animation looks like. So points, a point, eh, lucky roll here. So you can roll again once all six die are selected, if you choose, or you could pass. For if I don't select anything here, it's going to be a Farkle. Um, that would be kind of how the real game is played. So rather than keep going, I can just go ahead and, and hit roll or pass. Um, and it'll bring up the Farkle screen just to show what it is. So in this case, all 500 of my points are lost. It's not tallied here on the OLED um, scoring screen. And then player two is up. So then you keep going until somebody gets 10,000 points. In which case, there's a little animation screen. Um, so that's pretty much the game. The OLED, like I said, keeps track of your points. So let's just do this for fun here. Right, so I tallied player two. He had 50 points. And now it's player player one's turn. Um, in this case, I just, I'm just i seeing three pairs. Six, six, three, three, two, two. And if you ever get confused, you can always refer to the scoring guide. Three pairs should be worth 1,500 points. 1500 pops up and rather than risk it I'll go ahead and pass and you can see that the score is updated and it keeps um, adding points as you go so player one let's just say I'll pass here on 100 it'll tally up to 150 so that's my game um, I really enjoyed making it like I said if you have any questions refer to my instructables page for how I built it PCB design schematic the code all of that stuff so Anyway, thanks for tuning in, and I'll catch you later.